This picture shows some aphids on the leaf of an orange tree. Shortly after radar equipment was installed at a nearby airport a number of years ago, I noticed that every few seconds all the aphids would tense up in unison and do sort of a little dance, as you see in the picture. Upon further investigation, I found that the interval of time between the activity of each dance coincided exactly with the rotation of the radar rotor device at the airport, which was a distance of approximately 14 miles. If all we had to worry about was the dangerous microwave radiation coming out of our radar stations, Doppler radar, weather radar, well, that is in itself causing a tremendous amount of detrimental effects on life itself, not just the human being, all species. But we have dangerous frequencies coming out of cell towers, Gwen towers, smart meters, Wi-Fi, cell phones, all the electronic gadgets pulsating microwave radiation into the environment. And now we are looking at perhaps the cumulative effect or something has drastically changed just this past year. And I'm going to show you some of the effects on trees and the effects on wildlife feral cats that they are not exhibiting behaviors that are characteristic of the feral population. Now, these frequencies coming out of Texas and Oklahoma, you are getting pummeled. And Texas in particular, 24 7, 7 to 10 days, these extremely low frequencies have been emitted out of Houston going into Louisiana. You sometimes have these frequency beams being shot out from the Austin area. Now you have one being shot out from western Texas, the Austin area reaching further north into Texas. The cut out lines in the blue, very defined, some fan out. These are extremely low frequencies, but all of this blue is coming out of our radar stations. It is 432 on the East Coast, 432 in the afternoon. And you can see other states are rather quiet, uh, not much activity going on in terms of the radar stations you see activity the weather taking place but you don't see what you see during the night the nighttime hours the East Coast it's rather quiet right now Mississippi Alabama you've got your beam shooting off um, which now I see, I have seen pretty regularly throughout this week, but Georgia, South Carolina, Tennessee, I've shown in many videos these very powerful, extremely low frequencies being emitted from upstate South Carolina, emitted from Tennessee going through western North Carolina, and that is a nightly and early morning occurrence. The Northeast, look, kind of quiet. Wow, okay. Well, you've got these frequencies being shut off, but um, you don't see the activity during the day that you do at night. Why is that? I thought these radar stations were about tracking air traffic and weather. Well, we have air traffic during the day, but this is what you see during the night. All of these microwave 
um, this microwave radiation pulsating throughout the night, covering pretty much the eastern half of the country, emitting dangerous frequencies. Why can't you sleep? Because these frequencies affect your melatonin. They deplete our melatonin. Melatonin, very important for a good night's sleep. Without melatonin, you don't get your REM stage. That stage of sleep, that is the deep sleep necessary to heal your body. But it's very quiet during the day. Um, they use these frequencies at night, I believe, to entrain brains. Yes, they can use these frequencies to mind control populations. The frequencies affect our physical health, affect our sleep, and they are really having a tremendously bad effect on all life. Whatever has been going on this past year, put the two together. What I have been seeing on these radar sites this past year, we have been blitzed with dangerous microwave frequencies. The cumulative effect, the cumulative effect from years and years of 24 seven saturation now it is taking a toll like I have never seen. You can see it in the trees. Now this is supposed to be fall. The leaves are not turning. Even last year they were still turning the way they normally did for autumn. Now they're just dying. Now they're just turning brown dying these leaves on this tree have been like this for several months you can see all of the fungal disease on the trees the leaves are they have black rims are autumn now the leaves are not turning the beautiful colors. Why? Because these trees are so sick. All of the fungal disease on the trees making the toll, the cumulative effect of these microwave radiations as well as other poisons coming from the geoengineering and um, the toxic aerosol spraying. But the frequencies also, they dry out the trees as you can see. Th th we had a lot of rain the trees, the bark is cracking, falling off trees. And our autumn now has changed significantly. No beautiful colors. Now they're just dying and falling off trees. I'm also going to link below to this site that has a tremendous amount of studies, the effects of our wireless world on birds and bees and trees and animals. But I want to read one section here. The animal sensitivity, animal electromagnetic hypersensitivity. A growing number of anecdotal reports show that there are variations in the degree of sensitivity to electromagnetic exposure displayed by animals, just as there are among humans. This is an inevitable consequence of biological diversity, even with a single species, including genetic variants and differences in diet, habit, and behavior. People with electromagnetic sensitivity often report that their pet, cat, or dog, if the animal is particularly sensitive, to electromagnetic exposure, prefers to find an area of the house or yard for sleep which the use of an electronic meter shows. 
It is the area that has the lowest level of electromagnetic pollution. Similarly, an especially sensitive pet typically avoids areas with especially high electrosmog. Even wildlife is trying to get away from these dangerous frequencies. The feral cats in my area have been displaying behaviors that are not characteristic of the feral population. They want in from outside. So I'm going to show you what I have been living for, I'd say, the past month. Every day, every night, and it has gotten worse. Hey, buddy. Hi. Okay. Well, watch your paw, honey. Watch your paw. I'm sorry, guys. Oh. Hey, guys. Hey, <laughs> you have to leave, buddy. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, honey. Oh, my God. What is going on? Okay. Who are you? Okay. Never seen you before. All right. Oh. No. Down, down, down. Come on. Down. Yeah, I'm with a very trusted military friend. Still at the
Hey, sweetie. You all have dirty noses. Yeah. You have a beautiful coat. Yes, you do. Yes, you will. You guys are so sweet. Hi guys. Hi. Hello. And hello. 